New details tonight on that mass overdose in Hopewell overnight. Seven children rushed to the hospital after taking prescription pills. 8 News reporter Ben Dennis has been following this story all day long. He is live with the latest on how the children are doing and what neighbors saw unfold at the house there in Hopewell. Ben, good evening. Hey there, Eric and Deanna, a wild story overnight. We don't know for sure what condition that these seven young children are in. That's because police told me that they were all expected to recover. But we called the hospital where five of them were sent to. They said that three were fighting for their life and two were in serious condition. But neighbors described a chaotic scene. One was in tears, but she described their bodies that went limp. Next thing we know, they're bringing up kids' bodies in their arms. Jessica Sadler couldn't believe what she saw across the street yesterday around 5 p.m. They were just out of it I, and slumped over. They were wearing no clothes. They had pull-ups on. I only seen two of the kids dressed. Seven children were rushed to John Randolph Medical Center in Hopewell. From one to seven years old, they had taken prescription meds. Police Lieutenant Cheyenne Casale. Speaking with the, the seven-year-old, he said that um, he had went to take his medication and that he uh, shared it with the other children. Why was a seven-year-old taking their own medication? Neighbor Harvey Knoll wonders this himself, also a witness to the horror. The only way that be that could happen is if you're not paying attention to them and you're leaving the medicine laying around. Three neighbors said the mother of four of the children left the house for the convenience store around the corner leaving behind her children and three others she was watching for a friend. But there were adults still in the house, a woman and this man. He didn't want to identify himself, but said he called 911 when he discovered the kids acting drunk. We weren't able to confirm his information. They just called him Uncle Rob. Police say they got a call for a welfare check four months ago to check on the children. But it was nothing significant, and there was no contact made when we did go by the house to check on them. They should have helped these kids before it got too late. After being rushed to John Randolph Medical Center just down the street, five of those children were sent to Chippenham Hospital in Richmond. Two went to VCU Medical Center. Also, they believe that two ventilators were used at one point. Stay with 8 News for this investigation as it develops, as is the condition of these seven young children. In Hopewell, Ben Dennis, 8 News.